Hey everybody, it's Hari Swaminathan from OptionTiger.com. We are looking at yesterday's price action, which was uh, a very huge down day in the markets. The S&P went down by about 75 points. So if you were looking at the takes, then obviously, you know, the first half an hour to 45 minutes at the very least, you don't take any trade. So all of this is anyway hovering around the flat line. The markets did, did open a little lower. But then it started moving up and you can see the ticks really just one or two dots above the zero line. So, you know, it's going, it's going to be a negative day. However, this big plunge was uh, uh, due to the statements coming from uh, President Trump and uh, where he was asking all the U.S. companies to move out of China in retaliation to the tariffs. And so these kinds of news driven days in the market can produce some huge, huge, massive profits. So if you just studied the custom RSI and the takes uh, and you were waiting for uh, some kind of a persistent down move, uh, here you, you get your two reds and then the, the, uh, the third red as well over here. So you would get in after the two reds, let's say somewhere at this level, 2893, 2894. And then even though this is a green bar, I'm just going to step through very slowly so you can follow the logic here. The custom RSI is already in the bearish zone. So here you would get in around 28.94 or 28.93. And then the next one, even though it is a green bar, you can see the ticks uh, are red. The following one, it becomes a green tick. However, you don't get faded out by one. And so even through this up and down little U uh, shape there, you want to uh, uh, stay in the trade. And then, of course, the green ticks start again. And so once you see two green ticks, then you want to get out on this bar. So this is about 28.74. And so that's a good 20 point move. A 20 point move is good for about $6,000 if you just pick an uh, at the money option. I mean, I'm sorry, just slightly out, the out of the money option at a 35 delta. Uh, this is good for about uh, and just five contracts. It'll be good for about six thousand dollars. After that, then once you see these two, then you're just waiting. There are some smaller opportunities after, uh, uh, you know, of course, over here. You can see some persistent red dots here, some more red dots here. And then there is a nice trading opportunity towards the end of the day. And so if you took those three or four opportunities, you're probably looking at a ten thousand dollar day. But I wanted to walk through the process of how you would interpret the ticks as well as the custom RSI. So once again, if you look at it, the, the first two persistent dots here. So on the third one, you would get in. So as soon as you see the two dots, because we, you know, we don't want to get in right here because this is the first half an hour to 45 minutes. And you, you can also see the price action is not very uh, uh, smooth or, very, or not trending in any way. But once you see this, then you know you're looking at a bearish day. And so you, uh, uh, that's where you would jump in. This was obviously the big trade where the markets just went from 29.18 all the way down till about 28.65. So huge move there in, in the matter of about 40 minutes. And that's where the trading opportunity really was. But there was a, f a couple of others as well. You can see custom RSI pretty much was in the bearish zone all through the day. However, in terms of ticks, you did have two or three that came in and would have disrupted some of these trades. But that's OK, because you want to catch the if you catch the big move and even if you catch these smaller moves, each of these moves are worth about uh, 500 to a thousand dollars. And so uh, you could have easily this one was more. Actually, this one would have been more. You would have caught this over here and uh, that uh, that went down till about uh, for about 10 points there. And of course, you can, uh, you would have gotten out before the close. So uh, yeah, so yesterday, Friday, August 23rd was a big day. And if you had the SPX ticks and the custom RSI, uh, you could have made at the very least about 6,000 and perhaps about eight or 9,000 as well. Thank you. The SPX ticks as well as the custom RSI are uh, custom indicators and algos. If you have any questions, you can go to this bit.ly link, uh, bit.ly slash SPX algo, and you can find more information on how to get these indicators. Thank you.